So we're going to take a look at the Sigma 17 to 50 millimeter f 2.8 zoom lens. And I think this could replace your current kit lens. Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to the channel. This is Kevin Mendoza. And today we're going to go over the Sigma 17 to 50 millimeter f 2.8 zoom lens. And this is a very good replacement in my opinion for your current kit lens. Having started off shooting with Canon APS-C models, I know that their kit lens is an 18 to 55 millimeter f 3.5 to 5.6. And all that means is at the lens's widest angle at 18 millimeters, its lowest f-stop is going to be 3.5. And as you zoom in, that f-stop increases up to 5.6. And you cannot go lower than these f-stop values with their respective focal lengths. In simplest terms, you're not going to get much light at your widest angle at 18 millimeters, and it gets darker as you zoom in towards 50 millimeters. And this goes the same for Sony's kit lens, except the focal range is from 16 millimeters to 50 millimeters. Now this is Sigma's 17 to 50 millimeter f 2.8. That's right, it's not an f 2.8, 3.5, or 5.6, it's an f 2.8, throughout the whole zoom range. So unlike the other kit lenses that I just described, this will maintain a wide aperture from 17 millimeters all the way up to 50 millimeters. This means you're going to get a lot of light coming through the lens, which is definitely helpful in low light situations. And you're going to maintain a nice blurry background throughout the whole zoom range. As far as other features, this does have image stabilization. They just call it optical stabilization. And this does have pretty fast autofocus, except if you're doing video, I warn you, that the autofocus on this is kind of loud. All right, so let's see if you could hear this. So despite the audible autofocus, in my opinion, this lens is very fast and accurate when it comes to autofocusing. Now, if you're shooting photo, the autofocus noise may not matter so much, but if you're shooting video and need to capture audio at the same time, this lens may not be the ideal choice. And there you have it. That is my super quick review of the Sigma 17 to 50 millimeter f 2.8 lens. You can find a link to this lens in the description box below, as well as a complete list of all my camera gear. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, don't be shy to show me some love and hit that like button. If you want to see more videos like this, consider subscribing. I do have some more gear reviews and tutorials coming up. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.